Hey guys, what's up? Uh, so we, Joe is finally here, and we are going to do some trailer reactions. Uh, the first one coming up is Injustice 2, uh, a game that I kind of knew was coming, but yet didn't think that you know the license could could maybe handle a second one. Which I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I maybe it can handle a second one. But Joe, I'm a little scared at. Uh, what they're gonna be doing with Superman? So here we go. I'm always scared for that. Uh, I just I didn't like the whole bad guy Superman thing, and now they're just milking it. And God knows we'll probably get that in Zack Snyder's murder verse in the movies as well. God, Superman just being shit on. He's completely taken completely in a different direction than I'd like to see. Anyways, let's watch the trailer and see if this is in fact the case. Three, two, one, go. Another room! Yeah, they do good stuff. Soups. Oh. Oh, they say painful. that battle changes you. Break him in half. If he's gonna be evil, I want him to get destroy. him. Yeah, fuck it. Get him, soups. What the? Wait a minute. Why is? I thought they were supposed to be against each other. I thought Batman was fighting Superman, but no. Are they on the same side? Is this a monster in the night? Oh no! It's just everybody oh, fight yeah. everybody <laughs> now. Fucking Aquaman. Is he, is he dead? He speared him. <laughs> He's gotta be dead. <laughs> Wait, what? But how? You don't need kryptonite for Each Aquaman. Time I enter the pit. I emerge reborn. Okay, they're doing something with armor. Put the Flying devil pit. On Classic the red eyes. And what are you talking about? Show up. Ooh, Supergirl, sweet. Evolved. Adapted. What the fuck is this? Iron Prepare. Man bullshit. To fight. Batman Beyond. Each time I enter the pit. Okay, Injustice Two coming 2017. Yeah, Supergirl. So, uh, okay, I was expecting some actual gameplay, but this is the very first uh, announcement trailer, so obviously no gameplay there. But what we can gather uh, from this, and let's go ahead and go into the, the main view. So, uh, what we can gather from this is that... I can't get much of the story. They're probably still keeping the story under wraps. Yeah. This just seems like a a, a cinematic it's a free for all. Awesome. For, yeah, free for all <laughs> cinematic just for the trailer announcement. I don't think that we're actually going to see this in the story because everybody is fighting everybody. Um, Superman's costume has been changed. I gotta say, I hate it. And he's got gloves for I some reason. I fucking hate it. But you know, it's really hard to get Superman's costume right uh, when you change it. I think that Man of Steel did a good job on their costume. With no underwear. Uh, with no underwear. I thought that Superman Returns was kind of shitty as the fucking, like, maroonish cape and, and like, uh, boy shorts. I didn't like that. Um, but, you know, I, at first I didn't like Superman's costume in the first Injustice, but I grew to like that one. This one... I don't like, like right off the bat. They look like PJs. They look like PJs. It looks cheap as hell. Like, this is a terrible, terrible Superman costume. I'm sorry. Whoever drew this, you made me mad. You done fucked it up. You done fucked up Superman. I mean, I like that we've seen red and black. Uh, it looks like red and black, I think, on the inside instead of yellow. But, uh, yeah, no. So, at first, I thought Flash is fighting Superman. Flash is on the side of Batman. Yeah. And they're continuing the storyline where Superman is a fucking bad guy. Uh, but they're not going to do that. Um, you know, they, they, they drop some little teasers and hints in, in Injustice. 
Um, and so we still don't know what's going on here. This is just a free-for-all, just like the fighting yeah. game. Okay. Um, the biggest feature of this free-for-all, though, is when... Changes you. So, what is going to be the big mechanic in Injustice 2? It looks like your fighters power will power up somehow and turn into fucking Iron Man from Marvel and put Why on metal. On that bandwagon? What is going on? So, I don't like that bandwagon. Number one, maybe it makes sense for Batman. Maybe it makes sense for Flash because they don't have super strength, but it doesn't make sense for Superman. It doesn't make sense for Supergirl. It doesn't make sense for anybody with any super strength because it doesn't add to it at all, really. Okay, it's so then you had. Factor they're trying to do. Yeah, you have Batman coming in here, beating the shit out of Flash, which Batman is a fucking badass. And now that we have the Ben Affleck version of Batman, I always think of that and how good of a fighter he is. So I'm excited to play Batman again. And this is where I'm surprised he's not dead. He's night. totally dead. Fuck! A fucking <laughs> that Batman is dead. I'm sorry. And he's then they tried so went through him come on yeah so this is interesting they're going with the classic. comic well a cross between a classic and the injustice look uh because he's got blonde hair again and he's a big old white guy and honestly after the jason momoa That's uh, all you know it makes islands more sense. It makes again more an sense. islander it makes way more sense for aquaman to look more like a As jason momoa a surfer california guy yeah who <laughs> nah doesn't work out you, the the Islanders need a hero of their own, too, and, and somebody that they can relate with. And, you know, because a lot of these islands in real life, Joe, are sinking and we're the, the sea level is rising. <laughs> Aquaman, save us, take us to the city of Atlantis. <laughs> I'm just playing. But, no, I, I really think that the, the blonde hair, white guy version of Aquaman is, is kind of played out. And if there is one character that would get a complete change, uh, I think that uh, Aquaman uh, in the Z Murderverse, Snyder's Murderverse, is a little bit more interesting. Like Even though in the in the movie, all Aquaman did was he had the stupidest fucking part. Like I don't know what in the he shampoo was in. commercial. <laughs> where you see, you see his wavy hair. <laughs> and then like, you is that what he did Joe? yeah and then he takes off <laughs> and then he took off like, or he hair? like blew up a robot or <laughs> okay that's funny as well all right so we got aquaman here kills batman but apparently batman before he dies throws it Hunting. and electrocute shocks i guess aquaman but yeah. he kind of looks slightly different there and then Okay, so it makes sense for Batman to armor up, but this is dumb looking. I, I'm sorry. I don't think this helmet is very... Am I allowed to say that? Am I allowed to give you guys... You this, is, you this is my That's brutally what... honest opinion. Why am I asking you if it's okay? I don't like the helmet. Let me see the rest of the suit. Maybe it comes together in a better way, but this helmet on its own... There we go. Yeah, the suit is cool. The helmet, maybe so this not. This is phase one. See, each time I enter the pit. Uh, what, what is you in this pit, Joe? This Stop saying pit. pit. There's a fighting pit. It's a free for all. Okay, you're looking Amazing. for clues to the game. You think there's going to be a pit in the game? Yes. Good job, Joe. Good job. Because one of Four the guys minutes. said pit. Joe thinks there's going to be a pit in the game. Mark his words. Yeah. <laughs> all right. We got Superman. Does he armor up? Of course. Oh, no, he gets hit by Supergirl, and she armors up. Sort of. It looks like her armor is not intentionally, you know, uh, protective. You know what I'm saying? Maybe it's just decorative, but then again, if that's the case, then why? Aquaman evolved. Evolve, adapted. They're really playing up the fact. There goes Superman's. Oh. To see something around Superman's head like that, like Robocop and Iron Man, I don't know. I mean, that's sweet, because that's Batman Beyond. That's a new take on Batman Beyond, and then he's running like a fucking badass, and they all come 
together right there. Well, I like how everybody gets like their full transma- or transformation. Aquaman just gets his one shoulder pad on the right. <laughs> 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 it takes an hour. It takes like an hour to transform <laughs> a shoulder pad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hold on. Everyone else is like, completely like. And um, Aquaman silly. is still <laughs> naked. Maybe his nipples get. <laughs> That's too much. (laughs) All right, guys. So, in Justice 2, we're going to Michael Bay eyes our DC characters, and that's going to be the big gameplay mechanic. So, I expect them to bring back all the originals. Here's what I want from a Justice 2 I want, uh, you know, balance the characters, still give us those badass, awesome attacks, maybe make them even more brutal. I know you were afraid because it's a different license to go Mortal Kombat on in Nether Realm, but make them a little more brutal and give us two. Of those super moves, you know, oh, the big yes, ones. Yes. Instead of just one, punching people into well, in into space, orbit. And then back. <laughs> but I had to do that multiple times. I want different ones. I've been asking you that, guys, for years. Please give us two, and then I will support this motherfucking <laughs> game out the ass. But this armor is weird, but you know what? It's different, and I'm open to it because you guys have been uh, doing such a good job on your fighting games that, you know what? This is one of those where I might not particularly be into the announcement trailer but i'm completely open to what you guys are going to show us so i'll be at e3 and i'll definitely try to get an interview on this and talk to him a little bit more about it and maybe grab some gameplay uh so leave some questions in the youtube comments about this one that i can ask the developers that you guys want me to ask whether they're stage transitions uh uh, environmental hazards anything like that guys and character roster too yeah pretty fun who would you want to see in this game that you don't see here hmm in the DC universe. For me, I want to see Darkseid. Yeah. And I want to see good. Black Adam. Yep. Shazam. Shazam. Maybe <laughs> the rock version of Shazam. Yes. Oh, wait, no, no. He's Black no, Adam. Yeah. So the rock version of Black Adam. And we still don't know who Shazam, who's going to play Shazam. But I've got some ideas on who would be perfect for Shazam. But anyway, I'll wait for that uh, when we start seeing those trailers. <laughs> All right, guys. See y'all on the next Angry Joe show. Bye. Oh, so what did you think? Overall, what did you think, Joe? You got my opinion there, but what do you think about this? Are you excited? It's just a little teaser trailer, Mm -hmm. but yes, I do like it. I'm excited for this free-for-all fights. We're DC guys, you know? Yeah, exactly. And and while our movies are not doing too great, (sighs) (laughs) our video games have been pretty good. But I want Superman. If he's going to be a bad guy, fucking destroy everybody. (laughs) But I'm. I feel you I don't on the whole trend. I, I feel I'm you on this sick of this. evolution stuff that's going on. I don't. I'm not digging it. I'm, I'm not almost. It. I'm almost gonna blame you and Justice for what's gonna happen in the movie theaters, uh, and and the comic <laughs> store. I'm blaming the it Justice comics. I'm blaming the Injustice video games for popularizing a Superman as the bad guy. And if we start to see it in the movies, it was you, Tom Taylor. All right, guys. We'll see y'all on the next Angry Joe show. Bye.